Whether it's for vanity or necessity, more and more women are choosing to wear hair pieces and extensions. But some in the industry are now coming under fire for hair deception. Now CBS2 investigates. Longer, thicker, more luxurious hair in mere minutes. Extensions are great to add length, to add volume, also to change texture. But this popular beauty trend is now coming under scrutiny for having a very ugly side. People have no clue of what they're really buying. Spencer Coburn, um, president of the American Hair Loss Association, says despite being a multi billion dollar industry in the United States, there are absolutely no regulations when it comes to the sale, importation, or labeling of hair used in extensions and wigs. We bought three sets of hair extensions from three different manufacturers and sent them to an independent lab for testing. All three, labeled 100% human hair, actually contained a mix of synthetic hair. It can melt and singe. There's PVC and plastics in synthetic hair. And hair from a yak. It's going to be a lot less expensive for them to kind of mix human hair with uh, animal hair. While it won't harm you, experts say you're not getting what you pay for. What's worse, Brett Butcher, spokesperson for Great Lengths, one of the largest hair extension companies, says there have been reports that some imported hair is being taken against the donor's will. There's reports that, that, that hair has been uh, resourced from Russian prisons. Uh, this is the reason we started the whole uh, setting fair standards, uh, which is um, a guarantee that our hair is ethically sourced and traceable. Courtney Adelie with the hair care company Main Choice says the industry needs to be regulated. I can't use the word organic and not have organic ingredients in my product. I think it should be the same standards for, you know, people who sell hair. In the meantime, Lisa Abbey with the beauty brand Fly Girl suggests reading the reviews of a company before you buy, especially off the internet. She also highly recommends consulting with a trained cosmetologist before getting extensions. It's really important to know what you're buying, uh, where you're buying from. Legitimate hair importers like Great Lengths buy hair from temples in India where worshippers voluntarily shave their heads in rituals of thanksgiving.